If this is your first class with us, here are a few things to keep in mind as you prepare for your course. This video pertains to the Level 101 and 201 training classes for 2020 Design. These are live online classes that meet for eight sessions. So you'll be meeting for two hours in the morning and two hours in the afternoon for four consecutive days. Keep in mind that we keep these classes very small so that you have a chance to ask questions and work with your instructor. Your instructor will also invite you to optional office hours if you have additional questions that you would like to ask outside of the class. The very first step to prepare is to make sure that you have 2020 design software installed on the computer that you will log into class with. We are currently training on version 12.0.8.3. If you're not sure which version you currently have, you can open up 2020 Design and under the Help tab at the top, click on About 2020 Design and you'll see your version number here. Of course, if you'd like help updating your software, support is always available. You can give them a call directly or send them an email. The other software that is helpful for this class is Adobe Acrobat Reader. It's probably already installed on your computer, but if it's not, you can go right to their website for a free installation. The second step is to make sure that you've set up your desk. We strongly recommend using dual monitors, and I'll show you an example of that in a moment. When you join the live class, you can either call in from your computer or you can call in from a phone, so you'll probably want to use a headset or earbuds, just something that's going to make it easy to talk hands-free. You'll definitely want a two-button mouse with a middle wheel, and you're welcome to use your webcam if you have one, but it's not a requirement for this class. The recommendation for dual monitors is actually based on feedback from students who have previously completed our online classes. They found that it was easier to follow along if they had the instructor screen up on one monitor and their software open on the second monitor. Now, if you don't have dual monitors, it's okay too. You'll just wanna get comfortable with toggling back and forth between the windows. So here's a couple suggestions. When I open up 2020 Design, I can work in the software, but then at the task pane at the very bottom of the screen, I can always click back to the WebEx button to open up the live class. Now, in addition to that, if you have a widescreen monitor, you can also set your screen up to kind of share the screen real estate. So all I need to do is pick one of my windows and literally drag it to the far left or the far right hand side of the screen and it will equally divide your windows into two. Now here I can see the WebEx on the right and my 2020 design software on the left. Now obviously that takes up a lot of the room, so at different points I may want to maximize each software again to be able to see the class or come back over and maximize my software to be able to see my screen. And then I can always come back and bring it to the side of the screen and it'll try to divide it again for me. We also recommend high-speed internet and generally speaking a wired connection is usually going to be faster than wireless. So if you're able to plug in an Ethernet cable, that's definitely recommended, and you'll want to try to close all other background applications or browser sessions on your computer. You might even ask others in your office or your home office to limit their streaming activities during the live class. Now, as soon as you registered for your online class, you should have received an email from us with access to the 2020 Learning Center. This gives you 60 days access to each class, which includes your handbook, slides, practice exercises. You can even go back and play a recording of a class. So here's what that looks like. When you've logged into the 2020 Learning Center, you will see your classes listed on the left and a calendar view of your courses on the right. You can click on either of these to open up a course. When the class is open, you will see each individual session, any of the material that matches it, and if you like printed material, you can always come in and download these things ahead of time. So for instance, I can click on the handbook and I can download a copy of that. Now on the day of the actual class, you'll just wanna scroll down and you'll see all of your courses listed. About 15 minutes before the class begins, a large green button that says join will open up. You can click on that and it'll start the live class. And now for the last step, let's look at a live class. You're going to be able to ask questions or send in chat questions. You can give immediate feedback. You can share your screen. And of course, you can use your mute function if the phone happens to ring or your dog decides to bark at the mailman. Now during each live class, we use WebEx, and this allows you to see the instructor's screen immediately. You can also open up the participants panel in the chat window to interact with the instructor or the class. For example, I can raise my hand, I can give feedback like saying yes or no, or even a round of applause for my instructor. If I decide to send a chat question, it can either go to the instructor or to everyone in the class. And if you ever get stuck during a class, the instructor can also make you the presenter, which allows you to share your screen and makes it a lot easier to be able to answer questions. We'll do everything possible to make it feel like you are in an in-person classroom. 
If you have any questions, reach out to us at residential.training at 2020spaces.com.